What's going on, everybody? I recently got a uh, blue lens, like a very wide fisheye lens, for my action camera, and this is what um, this is what it looks like. Today, I'm going to the hardware store to get a couple more pieces of wood for a sub for build I'm doing, and so I think I thought it would be cool to just document my journey. Let's go. Alright guys, I think that we are here. They say they want jelly as well. So, here we are. You guys, the keyword is a lot. Want to home? All right guys, so this is what I've come up with so far. We got some extra boards right here. I'm probably gonna use this one as the bottom, but that's the face of it. We got three, four of them subwoofers. We're making a box for it, baby. That's what we got the wood for. What's going on guys? We're back in business. It's the next day. And I have the subwoofer built out right here. It's all finished with its one, two, three cones. I'm going to start up this, um, decibel level meter right here and i'm gonna put this right here i think the uh, port is a little goofy it looks curved but it's probably not too much of a problem we got australian state of mind slowed and we're gonna try it out hey bob it's time it's time bob bob you did stay at the port of stunning direct inside of the car. That is very loud. I think we just said 95 decibels. if y'all want more like vlogs and stuff in this format or vlogs in general because i mean i try to strive for like perfection in a lot of things it's just hard for me sometimes to hit record and then just start talking you know what i'm saying i'm always worrying about the memory card fill up the time i'm going to be spending editing cutting out random stuff i'm saying but in reality it's all for you guys and so if you want more of this why not i could make more all in all, I made the subwoofer mainly to um, just put some old drivers I had lying around to use. It was like, why well, have subwoofers and no box for them? So I went and I built a box. It cost like 30 bucks. And it does a pretty good amount of SPL. I'm thinking next time I do a subwoofer, I'm gonna try going for a folded topped horn. I think I'm saying that right, but there's a type of enclosure that lets you have not very high wattage subwoofers and very high decibels. Just search up folded tap horn subwoofer enclosure on Google or something. You'll see what I mean. I don't know. I think we can get away with that. We can test it and it could be pretty cool. So let me know if y'all want to see that in the comments and I will talk to you next time. Adios.